Hello folks and welcome back to the channel. Um, I decided to make this short video just to address some issues with the Oz Scene Reef World Scenery. Um, they've just released version 1.0.2 which they sent me and I think will be pushed out to customers very shortly. I just wanted to discuss um, what's been fixed and what works. As far as I can see, pretty much all of the drone camera issues have been solved. I used the drone camera all over the place, inside and out, backwards and forwards, close look at the scenery, um, we'll get some images um, close up of the boats to prove that it all actually works and there were no water crashes at all. Um, I used the Airbus H135 helicopter and was able to place it on all four of the pads in the scenery with, again with no problem at all. Um, the only problem we, we incurred was um, on ramp 4 occasionally if you load from the main menu the 135 helicopter onto that pad and you delay in clicking the fly now button just before it loads then there is a chance it will load inside the, the sloop and you'll get a water crash but if you make sure you click the fly now button without delay it shouldn't, sh shouldn't be a problem at all so that seems to work pretty well um, using the Bell 47G helicopter, which I have in the previous video to examine this scenery, again, no issues with flying around, and actually I was able to land on all of the pads, although the skid did sink in. But, on this occasion, no water crashes at all. No problems at all, actually. I was able to put down on the pad, um, in some cases not actually right in the middle, and lift off again and I did this with all four pads and it all worked. I then left the helicopter for 10 minutes with the engine running on pad 4 before I lifted off again and finally headed back to Hamilton Island. And again, no problems at all with this. Um, it all works. So the version 1.0.2 of this scenery seems to solve all of the issues that I certainly I have found. Um, the only thing is we now get play inside our investigating whether or not the Bell 47 is at fault um, in terms of this scenery and I've asked them to consider possibly producing a float version of the helicopter which might be a, a, an improvement. The, the aircraft was released with floats um, in the early days to various um, if any of you watched any of the James Bond early films I think Diamonds Are Forever you'll see one of these with the floats on it. Oh, sorry not Diamonds Are Forever um, what was the one in the Caribbean? I um, can't remember which one it was, but uh, anyway, um, I'm certain it was in one of the James Bond films. So um, I can thoroughly recommend the scenery, certainly version 1.0.2, you'll be able to examine it and enjoy it. I think it's brilliant. Um, I did a lot of testing today, some two hours or so to make sure it all worked, and I'm pleased with the results. So this is Lee, um, we've been looking again at the new latest version of the Reef World scenery by Ausseen and it's, it's really brilliant, I'm very pleased with it, can thoroughly recommend it now. So thanks for joining me in this short review, um, hope it helps you, I'll see you in the next video, take care, bye bye for now.